I'm gonna call you on my break. Yo, this nigga really think I'm going to work. <laughs> Yo, I just went through this nigga phone so much. We going to your house. When we get to your house, I'm gonna need you to blow my back out, like, pound my shit. Like, why you always recording? <laughs> Now, family, what was the first thing that came to your mind when you saw that video clip just right there? I'm going to tell you, the first thing that came to my mind was three things. Number one, you can't keep her. Number two, if I can't trust you, I can't be with you. And number three, there is nothing new. We just now got it on tape and we got the receipts. Number one, when I say you can't keep her, that doesn't mean you can't keep the woman. It means that all these superficial things that you think will keep a relationship together will never do it. You looking good won't do it. You having money won't do it. Putting a ring on her finger won't do it. Marrying her, buying a house. Any deed you can think your kindness will not keep her. Only thing that will keep a woman is a woman wanting to be kept. That's number one. Number two is this is nothing new. Nothing new under the sun. The only difference now is we got the receipts. It's just like when black folks was talking about police brutality and white folks was like, yeah, how, where? And then in 1991, 92, that video of Rodney King came out and it came across the screen. It was like this epiphany. Wow. Police really are beating black people to death. And now we know it's real. And then people got cell phones and camera phones. And now you're seeing everything play out publicly. So what I'm saying with this woman is it's, it's, it's no new thing, women doing this. And we always get this image that men are the, the dogs. Men are the ones out here being uh, trifling and dealing in infidelity. And your sweet, precious queen is just at home being a good woman and being shat on. And it's not true. People do these things, men and women. And now we're in the age you see with the Cat Williams and all these different videos, month after month, Puff Daddy truth is being unveiled and i think we're going to come into the next year with a whole new set of glasses and they're not going to be peachy and sunny anymore and by no means am i saying this is all women just like all men don't uh cheat and do wrong and dog the woman no man should have to deal with that no woman should have to deal with that in the world we living in you got stds stis women getting pregnant by another man then coming to the man she's with and telling him it's his it's just too many risks. So if you want to play the position and be out in the field, then, then don't be in a relationship. That's what, That would be my advice. And women are always going to be able to get it because you know what? There's a dude out there that's saying, great, I get to get the sex. I get to get all the loving and I don't got to deal with any of the attitude, any of the back talk, any of the emotional roller coaster, paying bills, trying to please you as a human being. I just get all the fun. So unlike the women, the men love being the side dude. And the last thing I'll tell you is it's totally the opposite for the women. Because usually the women who are messing with the guy on the side, they really want something with him. They don't just want the sex. They'd rather be with the guy that they're out there having the affair with. That's the difference between men and women. Men cheat, women cheat, but there's a totally different way of looking at it when they're doing it. But tell me what you think about that video.